Greetings on today's video I am going to show an overview of the latest version of KD Neon and some of the applications pre-installed. KDE Neon is a Linux distribution developed by KDE. Based on the most recent Ubuntu long-term support release, bundled with a set of additional software repositories containing the latest 64-bit versions of the Plasma 5 desktop environment slash framework, Qt5 toolkit and other compatible KDE software. First announced in June 2016 by Kubuntu founder Jonathan Riddell following his departure from Canonical, it has been adopted by a steadily growing number of Linux users, regularly appearing in the top 20 on DistroWatch.com's popularity tables. It targets the same user demographic as Ubuntu's official KDE Plasma-focused distribution, Kubuntu differing primarily in the much shorter time frame for users to receive updated Qt and KDE software. It is offered in four release channels, User, Testing, Unstable, and Developer Editions. The KDE Neon Linux distribution is focused on the development of KDE. The emphasis is on bleeding-edge software packages sourced directly from KDE and offers programmers early access to new features, but potentially at the cost of greater susceptibility to software bugs. The initial release of KDE Neon was on June 8, 2016. KDE Neon uses SystemD as is in its software and supports BTRFS, X3, X4, JFS, RicerFS and XFS file systems. For package management KDE Neon uses apt. Here you can see the commands to install software from the command line using the apt package manager. For self-contained applications, KD Neon uses Snap and Flatpak. KDE Neon includes version 5.8.0 of the Linux kernel. Some of the default applications of this release of KDE Neon are Firefox, KDE Connect, Ocular, VLC and KWrite. Please feel free to tell me what you think of the latest release of KD Neon in the comments section. Thank you for watching the video and please help the channel by sharing leaving a like and subscribing.